St. Basil's Church on the campus of the University of St. Michael's College in downtown Toronto, the National Catholic Broadcasting Council presents Daily Mass. The televising of today's Mass is made possible by a contribution from an anonymous donor in North York, Ontario. This Mass is offered in memory of her husband, parents-in-law, for the souls in purgatory, for graces and blessings received, and for the televised daily Mass and priests. On behalf of all those across Canada gathered to celebrate this Eucharist, we thank you for your generosity. Our Mass today is that of the Blessed Virgin Mary. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. May Jesus, born of Mary, be with you all. And also with you. We pause for a moment to recollect ourselves, to bring ourselves in body, in mind, and in prayer into the celebration of this Eucharist. Lord have, mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Let us pray. Lord God, give your people the joy of continual health in mind and body. With the prayers of the Virgin Mary to help us, guide us through the sorrows of this life to eternal happiness in the life to come. Grant this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the book of the prophet Joel. Thus says the Lord, let the nations rouse themselves and come up to the valley of Jehoshaphat, for there I will sit to judge all the neighboring nations. Put in the sickle, for the harvest is ripe. Go in, tread, for the wine press is full. The vats overflow, and their wickedness is great. Multitudes, multitudes in the valley of decision. For the day of the Lord is near in the valley of decision. The sun and the moon are darkened, and the stars withdraw their shining. The Lord roars from Zion and utters his voice from Jerusalem, and the heavens and the earth shake. But the Lord is a refuge for his people, a stronghold for the people of Israel. So you shall know that I, the Lord your God, dwell in Zion, my holy mountain. And Jerusalem shall be holy, and strangers shall never again pass through it. In that day, the mountains shall drip sweet wine, the hills shall flow with milk, and all the stream beds of Judah shall flow with water. A fountain shall come forth from the house of the Lord, and water the Wadi Shittim. Egypt shall become a desolation, and Edom a desolate wilderness, because of the violence done to the people of Judah, in whose land they have shed innocent blood. But Judah shall be inhabited forever, and Jerusalem to all generations. I will avenge their blood, and I will not clear the guilty, for the Lord dwells in Zion. The word of the Lord.
The Lord be with you. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. While Jesus was speaking to the people, a woman in the crowd raised her voice and said to him, Blessed is the womb that bore you and the breasts that nursed you. But Jesus said, Blessed rather those who hear the word of God and obey it. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise 